All right, this is my printer status stick. The LED lights change depending on the status of the printer. I think it's pretty cool, and I'd like to share it. All right, so this is the code for it. Um, your SSID, your password for your Wi-Fi. Um, this is where your URL goes to connect to the printer that you put in the browser. Um, this is the pin that you're going to connect to on the Pi. Uh, this is how many LEDs are on your strip. This is this is just all the logic. And we'll go down to the main loop. So this is just telling it telling the LED strips what to do. And if you have it connected to the printer or to the computer, it will display this all in the in the shell down here. And it'll look like that. And that's it. Change this if you uh if you like, but don't go too low. One second is probably minimum. All right, the build is pretty easy. The uh, Pi is just wired up to the five volt in that comes from a USB. And then the five volt is connected to the LED strip. And the ground is then connected to the Pi. All right, editor's note. So this is a USB plus minus. Plus goes to the LED strip plus and V bus. The minus goes to the LED strip minus and also the ground on the Pi. And then the dim, which is the data input for the LED strip, goes to the GPO 14 or whatever pin you decide. So. I hope you like my diagram. It's pretty easy and the thing just slides up. That's about it. I mean, I designed this. I'll include the CAD and uh, everything slides in there. So you want to feed everything up through these holes. The pie will fit nicely in there just like so you can still program it if you need to after the fact and everything is just in there these holes are for uh, T-nuts that go in the slot and it's all put together that's it all right, so this is it put together. Just got an M3 screw with a uh, washer on the on there, and that's it. So I'll show you what it does now. All right, so this is it in printing mode. I'll go ahead and pause it. So we're gonna wait for it to go to pause. So now it goes from green to blue. Ignore the printer. And now we'll cancel. And once it updates. A few moments later. and the error mode. And then we'll go back to operational. And it's just idle. There we go.